This city, these buildings, we even have a courthouse. We are told this is our escape from nature, freeing us from the constant war we would live in otherwise. Sure, the lights are pretty, but nothing changed. We still live in a state of war. I recognize that. So, I do what I do, and I'm excellent. We play with the gifts given, and mine happens to make me rise high. Tonight, a million dollar heist is taking place in the middle of downtown Los Angeles. I suppose money can't buy sense. I don't feel grounded by much. I don't care much for the world. I know it feels the same about me. That's a fine situation. I shouldn't even mention it, really. It doesn't matter to me the intelligence of my target, though few qualities really would. The compensation matters little. It's the task itself that holds significance for me. Money dies. That's some serious scenario. That's some money. I make an effective weapon. A skillful, balanced artist. A maker of death. Jobs back to back. My art pays well. Discipline is of the utmost importance. To operate at my level, to ensure my finest work is executed, I must remind myself of the highest truth, that perfection exists only in the ether. So that is what I must be, fading up, becoming invisible. Who are you? Lots of charitable work, I see. I do enjoy a chance to play dress.
Good luck tonight, buddy.
Understood. Sir, I'm not sure what happened. You did your job, son. Don't worry now. But I didn't. Someone else was there. It's a two-man job. You weren't aware. But it went okay. The night had to die. Understood, sir, but I could have done it alone. Maybe, but I picked two tonight. Who's the other? Well, slow down. He's meeting us here. He's just cleaning up a bit. Tying up some ends, I decided to give some extra grunt work. I'm sorry, am I late? Am I being replaced? No, son. Playborn, completed your tasks. Yes, sir. All tied up. All right, then. Let's pay and get to assignments. I work for this. These criminal contractors? Who would have guessed they would have so much security guarding their government proxies? Our client was part of Mr. Knight's little group. His weekly games and such. But at a certain point, he got pushed out because he wasn't giving as much as he took. But our client sure as hell bit back, didn't he? I would do this. Consider this a finder's fee, if you will. Sure. Thanks for fetching it. Thank you for that, Claiborne. Your assignments. I have one project for you, son, and when it's complete, I have something extra with your name on it. No, not yet. Let's talk about it. New, may go. You're free to go. Thank you, sir. I'm happy to take that extra assignment if you need me to. It won't be necessary. You'll, you'll have something for me soon, though, right? It'll be yours. Go. Sir, I'd like to make up for tonight. It went to plan. I know, sir, but... No! Just go! Bye now.
He is my curse. Night, the boss, all of it is his fault. My discipline is unwavering. Mistakes are impossible. I'll kill him with my bare fucking hands. Jealous much? You know this is a private beach, right? Alright. Get off, or I have to teach you another fucking lesson. You were meant for me, but I can't hide. 